Hello friends, welcome to Need Storyboard. First of all, let me tell you what it is about. It is learning through pictorial symbol. First, I will tell you a story and then I will correlate that story with our topic. Today's topic is glycolysis. Let us discuss about glycolysis first. Glycolysis is the process in which a glucose molecule is converted into two molecules of pyruvic acid. Glucose is first converted into glucose 6-phosphate. Then it is converted into fructose 6-phosphate. Fructose 6-phosphate is converted into fructose 1,6-biphosphate which is then converted into two molecules of glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate. Glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate molecule is interconvertible with dihydroxyacetone phosphate. Glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate is converted into two molecules of 1,3-biphosphoglycerate which is then converted into two molecules of 3-phosphoglycerate. 3-phosphoglycerate is then converted into 2-phosphoglycerate. 2-phosphoglycerate is then converted into phosphoenol pyruvate. And these two molecules of phosphoenol pyruvate are finally converted into two molecules of pyruvate. Okay, now let's start. This is a story of a fairy word. And this is the glorious queen of fairy word. The glorious queen of fairy bird has lots of powers, but she wants more powers. For this, she is doing a ritual with her daughters to get fire phoenix. Here is the daughter of glorious queen who is telling the ritual. These are the two flower fairies who are accompanying the daughter of the glorious queen in spelling the ritual. All of them are having magical lamp which is having magical fire. Suddenly two butterfly come and converted into two beautiful girl fairies who are also carrying magical fire in their hands. There are two boy fairies. These two boy fairies are controlling the magical fire with the power of the trident. These two boy fairies are having a very powerful trident. With the power of this trident, they are controlling the fire bowl for the ritual. With the power of this trident, they are also commanding the non-fire phoenix. When these two non-fire phoenix gets the energy from the magical fire bowl, they are converted into fire phoenix. These fire phoenix will give tremendous power to the queen. Before we start correlating this story, I want you to assume one thing. What is that? The lamp which is in hands of these fairies is a symbol of phosphate molecule. The lamp in the hands of daughter fairies and flower fairies is assumed to be phosphate molecule with position of either 1 or 6. If it is in one hand, it will be 6 phosphate. And if it is in both hands, it will be 1, 6 biphosphate. For the girl fairies, the position will be 3 phosphate. You got that? Means if the lamp is in one hand, the position will be 6. And if it is in both hands, the position will be 
1 and 6. For the little fairy, the position will be either 3 or 1, 3 by phosphate. Okay. Now let's start. The glorious queen is a symbol of glucose. Glorious queen, glucose. The daughter fairy means it's a part of glorious queen. So, the daughter fairy will become glucose 6 phosphate. Daughter fairy is a part of glorious queen. So, it becomes glucose phosphate and the position of phosphate is 6. That is glucose 6 phosphate because she is carrying one lamb in her hand. Flower fairy, the first flower fairy with one lamp becomes fructose 6 phosphate. Flower is correlated with fructose. Flower uh, give rise to fruits. That's why flower is taken as a symbol of fructose. And she is carrying one lamp in her hand. It becomes fructose 6 phosphate. In the same way, the second flower fairy who is carrying a lamp in both of her hands, it becomes fructose 1,6 biphosphate. Fructose 1,6 biphosphate is converted into dihydroxyacetone phosphate. DHAP is symbolized by two butterflies here. DHAP is interconvertible with glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate. The girl fairies are symbol of glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate because they are carrying one lamp in their hands. Boy fairies can be correlated as phosphoglycerate. To boys fairies, are symbol of phosphoglycerate. You will have to memorize one thing that butterflies are taken as a symbol of DHAP. The other thing to memorize is glyceraldehyde is uh, correlated with feminine gender that is girl fairies while phosphoglycerate is correlated with masculine gender that is boys fairies glyceraldehyde female and glycerate male okay the glyceraldehyde 3 phosphate is converted into two molecules of phosphoglycerate position of fireball on the trident will make you to remind the position of phosphate molecules in the in the phosphoglycerate. The glyceraldehyde 3 phosphate is converted first into 1,3 biphosphate. As you can see that fireball are in the 1 and 3 position of the trident. The 1,3 biphosphoglycerate is then converted into 3 phosphoglycerate. This is memorized by 1 fireball in the third position. 3 phosphoglycerate is then converted into 2 phosphoglycerate. As you can see, that uh, the uppermost trident is having fireball in the second position. So, glyceraldehyde 3 phosphate, which is symbolized by two girl fairies here, first it is converted into 1 3 biphosphoglycerate. Then it is converted into 3 phosphoglycerate. 3 phosphoglycerate is then converted into 2 phosphoglycerate. Two non fire phoenix are make you to remember 2 phosphoenol pyruvate. Non fire phoenix, enol pyruvate. 2 phosphoglycerate is converted into 
2 phosphoenol pyruvate which is symbolized by 2 non pyrophenics here. 2 enol pyruvate is converted into pyruvate and 2 molecules of pyruvate are symbolized by 2 phenyx here. These are the substrates of glycolysis in which glucose is converted into 2 molecules of pyruvate. You have noticed that butterflies, girl fairies, boy fairies and phoenix are in pairs. This is used to symbolize that these substrate molecules are 2 in number. Fructose 1, 6 biphosphate is converted into 2 molecules of DHAB. And all the substrate after the DHAP will be 2 in number. Now let's revise once. Glorious fairy queen glucose. Daughter fairy with one lump glucose 6 phosphate. Flower fairy with one lump fructose 6 phosphate. Flower fairy with two lamps is reminded to fructose 1 6 biphosphate. To butterfly, I make you to remind dihydroxyacetone phosphate. To girl fairies, a reminder to glyceraldehyde 3 phosphate. To boys fairies, reminder to phosphoglycerate molecules. The position of phosphoglycerate molecules are symbolized by the position of fire in the trident. Firstly, 1,3 biphosphoglycerate, then 3 phosphoglycerate, after that 2 phosphoglycerate, which is then converted into 2 molecules of phosphoenol pyruvate, and finally 2 molecules of pyruvate. I hope you understand the topic. Thank you very much for being with me.